Ted Nugent likes Kanye West, and he praised Kanye West as a man of great vision. This is in light of Kanye West sitting down with Tucker Carlson wearing a WLM shirt. Now Carlson had said during that broadcast, and I quote, the enemies of his ideas dismissed West as they have for years as mentally ill, saying he's too crazy to take seriously. Look away, ignore him, he's a mental patient. There's nothing to see here. He went on to say that Kanye's rhetoric could be jarring, something used as ammunition against him in winning over the minds of young American people. Tucker then later asked, is Kanye crazy? And then said, you be the judge. I'm also saying, you be the judge. Like, subscribe, thank you. So Ted Nugent took to the nightly nuge, a new style thing where he shares up his views of the news. And he said that interview between Kanye and Tucker Carlson was quote, one of the most brilliant journalistic moments in the history of journalism. Nugent sees Tucker Carlson as a warrior, standing up for truth, logic, common sense, good over evil, right over wrong. Ted Nugent says that Kanye West is rock solid as an entrepreneur and an overall visionary. And it turns out that Ted Nugent's son, Rocco, works on Kanye's team, both at a musical and fashion level. And that Kanye stood for God, family, country, as well as the evil scourge of transgender confusion. Ted Nugent also spoke very highly of Kanye West's church chorus, full of the most gifted spiritual and soulful music out there. Ted Nugent also refers to the Kardashians as a bunch of rotten, horrible people. Ted Nugent also said that when Kanye got up there and shouted down Taylor Swift during the award show, that it was cute, but uncalled for, but harmless. He says that Kanye has been attacked for standing up for Christianity. Now, another quote from Ted Nugent really makes this interesting. He said, quote, if you want health, I recommend you get a bow and arrow and shoot a nice organic deer or a turkey or a hog or an elk or a pronghorn or a caribou or a moose. That's where you get a good diet. He goes on. In fact, I've been in touch with Kanye's gang, his people, his team, and Kanye wants to learn to bow hunt. He wants to get right in the belly of God's miraculous renewable creation and be self-sufficient. Ted Nugent then says, if ever there was a black heritage, it would be the hunting lifestyle. We got it from them. So I'll read the next Ted Nugent quote with my best Tucker Carlson impersonation. And here it is. A brave, ass-kicking, wall-destroying, lie-crushing guy? Tucker Carlson should be watched daily. And some comments on the blabbermouth story that followed are actually pretty entertaining in and of themselves. More on number one. Wipe off your chin pad and take the knee pads off. Incoherent buffoon. Or Ted's nose is completely brown from licking Trump's ass for years and years. Guess he's eating Kanye's ass for dessert now. Another one. Scum recognizes scum recognizes scum. Please take Kanye bow hunting with you, Teddy boy. Hopefully at least one of you will come back looking like a pincushion or even better. Why don't you all feed the bears? <laughs> So yeah, this is definitely one of those hot button issues. Thanks for watching. Make sure you like and subscribe. You are now in the family.